Hi, this is Taylor with Independence Aviation here bringing you an iPad tip of the day. I want to show you today how to easily add departure and arrival procedures using ForeFlight. So here I'm in the maps mode of ForeFlight and I've brought up the navlog function in edit mode. What I'm going to do is do a flight plan from Rocky Mountain Metro Airport to Albuquerque. So I'll go ahead and tap here to create a route, put in KBJC space KABQ as my identifiers, tap on return, and now I have the direct great circle route between the two. So in order to add procedures, it's very easy using the procedure button up here in the upper right hand part of the Navlog edit mode. So I'll tap on procedure and I know that I'm going to expect the Pikes 5 Alamosa transition departure procedure out of Rocky Mountain Metro. So I've brought up that. I'm looking for the Pikes 5 departure, there it is, Alamosa VOR is the transition and I'll tap on that and now I have my departure route showing from uh, Rocky Mountain Metro down to the Alamosa VOR. In a similar manner I just need to select the appropriate arrival so I'll go ahead and tap on the procedure button again, tap on the arrivals for ABQ and here I know that I'm going to expect the Freeho 4 arrival with the E-SPAN transition. And now I have the arrival procedure starting here with E-SPAN and there's the Albuquerque VOR with the Albuquerque Airport. Then I can also expect maybe to uh, fly Victor 83 from Alamosa down to the Taos before being cleared to eSpan so I can using the typical editing of ForeFlight simply tap on the departure procedure tap on insert after put in the Taos VOR which is TAS tap on insert select that it's the VOR in New Mexico and now I have my complete routing that is how easy it is to add for flight or er, procedures using the for flight app